Right, I'm going to show you how to lead load. So what we've got here is this was the petrol filler cap on this Morris Miner before I um, build that to it. Um, and I cut out a circle that was the right size and roughly the right profile, put it in there, welded it on. That welds all nice and happy. The repair patch is um, not leveled with this curve. That was done on purpose, so it's slightly set back. Uh, that's, that's not going to help anyone, but there it is. Um, what you want to do before you do any lead loading is make sure the area and quite a bit of the area around it is spotlessly clean and shiny. So I just want to lead load this bit so that that repair panel is brought up to the level of this. And so I know all the paint's off there. I got all that off with an angle grinder before I welded the panel in. Then went over it with an angry wheel on. That, so that is now ready for lead loading. So, first things first, get your uh, solder paste, a little brush, and just give that a good old paint over the whole area, ram it all in there, and put it past the area you want to lead load as well. So, overdo it, basically. Here in the background is my blowtorch, just having fun. What you need, blowtorch and rag. So, make sure I have much off. A little bit of this action. All over everything. You'll see it's sort of changing colour and starting to evaporate there. That's all the water coming out of the paste. Already, that's starting to go nice and shiny. Right then, so that's the uh, solder done. Now, you're going to get your sticker lead. Keep your panel nice and warm. And get your bit of lead. Give that some heat. Don't forget to sort of swap between the two and just make sure everything's heated up the same.
and then you just want to sort of press your stick into the area you want them there. It doesn't need to be neat or tidy at this point. Just get the lead on there. Stuff will fall on the floor like that. Not by the time. Right, that might be enough. So, next, we get our paddle. And we shove it in some tallow. But you don't want too much tallow on your paddle, you just want a very light sort of coating. Maybe a bit too much, right? always look awful while you're doing this. There's no way of doing this neatly or nicely, particularly the first time. Put a little bit more lead on, because at this point you always want too much rather than not enough. That is above the final level that we want it. So not massively, because obviously you're going to end up filing all this off. But one thing you must never ever do with lead is sand it, put an angle grinder to it, or anything like that. You must, must, must use a body file of some sort, because then it stays in those big chunks to sweep up. And technically you can reuse it, but You'll probably have paint in it and all sorts of other crud by the time it's fallen on the floor. So just wrap it up safely in a bag. Probably double bag it, you know, in his lead. So this is two minutes after I'm done and obviously still warm, but it's okay to start working on it. So what I'll do is I'll kick the camera and 
and you just get at it with the angry end. have it that's just 10 minutes after I started this whole endeavor and I've probably filed it down lead loading will never be the final finish um, I will put a skin of normal filler over that but you can see that's pretty good that's a nice little sort of filling in of that hole so that will just need a little filler over it bish bash bosh